A true rock star entrance. There is an electric feeling in this arena. Undeniable energy to his arrival. Setting the stage for what's to come next. The following contest is a fatal four-way match. Making his way to the ring from Kyoto, Japan. Weighing in at 220 pounds. multiple championships a top elite level competitor all over the globe after all these years a veteran who hasn't lost any of his edge shinsuke is battle tested and looks ready for more Shinsuke's proven it with newfound brutality. The American Nightmare is here. The son of a son of a plumber looking to continue the Rhodes legacy. with the form that Cody Rhodes has taken. He's become a leader, a mentor, and a main eventer. Those are all great things to be, Saxton, but we all know what Cody truly wants to be more than anything else. He's a world champion. Hard times and perseverance, Cody Rhodes embodies them all. All in the name of finishing the story that has eluded his father. Cody seems dead set on reaching the pinnacle in the name of the Rhodes family. One of the UK's best exports. And from Dudley, England, weighing in at 175 pounds, Tyler Bay. Well, Bate made a real name for himself on both sides of the Atlantic. A founding member of NXT UK and now a fixture in NXT in the U.S. Yeah, do yourself a favor and look up his NXT UK championship battles against the likes of Gunther and Butch. Some of the best matches in NXT history. Bate has run the show in every form of NXT but still has much to prove in all of WWE. Well, we have seen time and time again that Tyler Bate has plenty of heart. A pure will to win. It has allowed Bate to defeat much larger opponents. And there's no mountain Bate can't conquer with a little hard work and a little more mustache wax.
Ladies and gentlemen, here comes the phenomenal one. A man who exceeded all expectations in WWE and is now a first ballot Hall of Famer. And representing the OC from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ Styles. AJ Styles has a trophy case filled with titles. A WWE Grand Slam champion. This man has done it all, and he has absolutely no fear. There is one thing we've learned all throughout the years, and that's do not bet against AJ Styles. Hey, he might not be the biggest dog, but AJ Styles has got the strongest bite. And there's no one who fights bigger bell to bell than AJ Styles. You're right. If AJ's breathing, AJ's fighting. Trying to navigate the terrain of this fatal throwaway match will be no easy task for any of these superstars. Ready to get this started, we see Shinsuke Nakamura, Cody Rhodes, Tyler Bates, and AJ Styles. It might sound cliche, but you really do have to have eyes in the back of your head if you want to survive a match like this. It's a fatal four-way, not a friendly four-way, no matter how much Saxton wishes it was. Hey, I still think it could be a good idea. And when it's everybody for themselves, sometimes you just have to do what's needed to get the job done. There's common enemies everywhere. There's certainly an element of danger inherent in a no-disqualification match, isn't there, Corey? More than a lot of people realize. It's not just the superstar in the ring you have to worry about. You have to worry about everyone in the locker room that they're aligned with. The odds in this match can swing with or against you so fast. The head scissor takedown. Measured knee drop. Yikes, that don't even wake you up or knock you out. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear up, including us. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. No, no, that'll break his arm. Vicious. And going down at that angle did not. Pick him up. He can do it here. The figure four. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. You have solidified your name as a top bat. These men knew this match is going to be hard fought. Oh, elbow to the face. Shinsuke Nakamura landed one there. Brutal stomp to the body. And oh, and in the chest as well. Nicely done. Big forearm. Uh oh. Nakamura, so elusive. Followed by a knee drop. A fracture orbital. Down right on the neck. Great wherewithal on the counter. It wasn't the higher distance that caused the damage, but. They certainly contributed. And an inverted atomic drop. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Yeah, but at this point, Cole, the fatal four-way is still anyone's to win. Dropped with a suplex. Vicious right forearm. How insulting is that? Single leg takedown of their opponent, and there it is. It's time. Trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. Legs caught. Each competitor showing it. And here's a cover. And that does it. Beats the odds and gets. 
That's the fatal four-way win. Here is your winner, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. A truly stunning performance to win this fatal four-way match. An amazing performance, outlasting three different opponents. It was a real testament to his abilities. Please sit down, Byron. Please. I can't help sit down. it. I got a goosebump parade running up and down my body. The new day's here. A goosebump parade. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the new day from Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 285 pounds. Big E. Byron, I thought you didn't eat carbs. Well, I make an exception for the New Day. Get it. Ah, New Day rocks. Come on, Corey. New Day rocks. You're not clapping. Oh, oh, I ever. Big E's hips don't lie, man. Ships, Baron Corbin is raring for a fight. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. The lone wolf mentality is back. No one's safe. And his opponent from Kansas City, weighing in at 285 pounds, Baron. Baron Corbin's been a king, a jester, an authority figure, even a bum. Yeah, but now Corbin is truly himself. No more gimmicks. You have to be able to look past the shenanigans of Big E. Don't get caught up. You need to remain laser focused when you face off with Big E. And there's definitely a new spark in Baron Corbin these days. It seems he's rekindled something that might have flickered out some time ago. He is just so much more focused now. And we all know that a focused Corbin is a dangerous Corbin. And with Big E, we are looking at someone as positive as they are powerful. 
that might not. And now he's looking to lock in this submission. Abdominal stretch. Fighting out of That's it. That's one way to get out of it. Just mounted with punches. And not, oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. And a series of vicious stomps. Oh, man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. Insulting. The disrespect can be tasted in their mouth. Turning the tables. One response after another. Back and forth we go. He turns it around on Corbin. Plan here can't be good. Right across the larynx. It looks like the powerhouse of positivity got a bit locked. Corbin causing damage, causing harm. You know, Big E may be quite fast for his size, but he's still a big, big man. Speed is not his primary game, and speed is the ultimate key for his opponent tonight. You're right, Corey. Quick attacks could be the key to victory here. He ran to the midsection. Setting them up for the Falcon Arrow. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Whoa. Oh my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. <laughs> Biggie responds. Three. Four. Bash right into the post on the outside. All that training's paying off. He creates space with his legs. He may not be aware of the count. He's got to get back in. He's taking this to the floor now. And now thrown back into the ring. of Baron. Yeah, and that powerhouse nature of Big E's coming out. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Into a powerbomb! That was one of those powerbombs that would shorten someone's career. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Cuts off the attack with a big knee. And he thinks he has it. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Ah, uh, oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. Toss him to the side. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. All the way down. That kind of force in the arm can have lingering effects. Position here. Ooh, dropped right on their face. This match's brutality starting to show on him. Big E always has plenty more where that came from. What are they doing here? Getting the upper hand by taking away your opponents. Vicious right forearm. Any and all momentum has been taken from Corbin. Corbin might just be waiting for an opportune time. Put it in a position now. Straight impact on the throat. And here's a cover. Biggie digging deep for the kick out. Able to squeeze that shoulder out so close. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. Oh, the knee is being torn apart now. 
Expected that one. I don't know. No way. Astounding power. End of days. Corbin might take it here. Try to end it. And a kick out. No one saw that coming. What a kick out. The power of positivity lives on. Well, Big E used to say three ain't enough. And clearly that goes both ways. And you know this is only going to make Corbin angrier now. He wanted to end things right there. one i suppose corbin backed up all his cockiness with this win cry about it saxton baron corbin is back on top Now, one team ready to go, and here come their opponents. Very important match. Hey, oh, wait a, minute. a blindside attack from this other duo. This could greatly affect the matchup we were scheduled to see. Greatly affect the match? Are, are we even going to have a match after that attack? It's a great question, Byron. I mean, the opponents obviously still want to continue, but I'm not sure this team is in any condition to compete. I agree with you, Saxton. I don't know if this is the wisest choice they can make. Well, they're still insisting on going forward this matchup. I don't know if this is smart. Well, you know the old saying, if you're going to be dumb, you got to be tough. Well, the attackers obviously were not That's supposed to be part of this match. And now this team has got their backs against the wall. Buckle up. This one's going to be ugly. There's the bell into this highly anticipated match. So anticipated, these combatants couldn't even wait for the bell. Certainly a very dramatic start to this contest. Just goes to show how intense this match is going to be. Yeah, clearly this fight has been a long time coming, and now there is no more holding back. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Counters! Powerful suplex toss! Not the prettiest thing you'll ever 
ever see, but it sure looks effective from here. Oh, oh world's strongest splash! And into the count. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. The better part of Valor. Whip back into the ring. Look at this. Snap suplex. He turns it around. Headbutt to the back of the neck. What a chancery. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just got to toss another person to make a statement. It's got to be demoralizing when you're the combatant on the wrong side of the double team. Maybe you want to rework the game plan about now. Oh. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. Back and forth from these competitors. Seeing an answer for... Guillotine apply. And the ropes forced to break. He did not want to be caught in that submission any longer. you want to be in right now. Oh, my God. Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. What a barrage of stops. The proverbial mud hole has been stopped, and now it's time to walk it dry. I'm just being tossed away there. I'll just leave it at this. Nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that. The referee County urging them to get in the ring. Right. Nicely done. Talk about a close call. Yeah, the referee was dangerously close to making it to 10 right there. Oh, what a ladder bomb. That is the kind of move that leaves our jaws on the floor. Unbelievable. After humble beginnings, this has really grown into a career-defining conflict for these superstars. For years, their names will be spoken together as everyone recalls the war they waged against one another. Yeah, this is history in the making, guys. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. What are they doing here? You can see the intent behind that attack. Exploiting the arm must be the strategy here. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Got to hurt. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Isolating the arm. Hard to grab or apply a proper hold after a move like that. This tag team is just tremendous working together. Double teams. And it's about to get worse. Oh, draping double axe handle. Anderson showing zero restraint. And I bet Carl's look shoulders down. Just after two. Not yet. Planning on what to do next. Dear, this doesn't look good. Alley -oop. Sandman got it taken to him there. And Gallows just unleashed that brawling offense there. He's been placed in the corner now. He catches Gallows with a big counter. A uh, takedown. And now punches right. Vicious, aggressive attacks. Oh, just gouging the face. That's not right. Stop in the leg. Ooh, targeting the leg there. Sandman with a counter. 
Solid punch. Into the cover. Oh. He's able to beat a two count. Kicking out now sends a very clear message. What a forearm. into the action. Look at this, just what a barrage of stops. Headbutt to the back of the neck. With the reversal. Tough position to be caught in here. Some serious offense. Ooh, forearm connects. Well, this is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. Ooh. And he's able to us. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Tossed into the corner. And he saw that coming from Eric. Big time shoulder block with a corkscrew. And Eric with the counter. Well scattered reversal there. Reciprocating the initial reversal. Tag made. What are we going to see now? The OC. Looks out of it. The cover. Oh, I thought it was over, but again. Can we please get some control? It has been a constant barrage from each of these competitors. Almost a hazardous amount of punishment has been dealt. It's got to be concerning. Clearly, neither man is worried about their well being. The WWE Universe can't believe what these Warriors are doing to one another. Everyone's fired up. What a battle. In a corner. Uh-oh. Able to avoid any harm there. He got whipped into that corner. Headlock a pie and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. You can't take much more of this. He can really stand to get back as good as he's getting right about now. Locks in the gut wrench. All the way up and boom! Here comes the buster. Uh, tag made. Oh, right to the gut. Man, oh man. Yokes up their opponent. Sidewalk slam delivered. Hoisting up their opponent. Wow, what a spy buster. Tag is registered. with the back elbow. A Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Double big back body drop. Anderson muscles up his opponent. Into the gun stun. Anderson could seal things up. He keeps his team in the match. Punch! Bulldog brings them down. He's 
getting pushed out into the defensive. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? How are they gonna hear after this match? Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm, has the arm trapped. Goodness gracious. Tag is made. Belly to back suplex. No! Belly to back penalty kick by Eric. Is it enough to overcome Anderson? Punch lands. Eric looking to keep up that Viking energy. He's certainly lining him up, but he's wasting too much time. Uh-oh. Boom! Scorpion death drop. There it is. Boom. Nice. Luke Gallows in with the tag. Caught with a punch. Setting up for something here. Ooh, been playing the trachea. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. Ah, oh, stops the legs. A oh, big kick to the gut. The clubbing for him. Oh, just gouging the face. Face gouge. Oh, God. The Sandman setting himself up top. Up high. Rolling rock Sandman from It could be over here. This is it. Thank goodness oh. for the teammate. Not Just quite. in time. Ow. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. This is truly awesome. What a punch. Up into the fireman's carry. And bang! Jack. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Caught him. Tag is made. What are we going to see now? The OC. The magic killer. Will Gallows close this out? Cover. And he makes the save for his team. Just breaking down the opponent. It's been a struggle for these competitors to find an end to this match. But the struggle's worth it. With every move you make, you hear this capacity crowd following you on that journey. Right into a big boot. He manages to escape it. DDT! Their opponent's oh, legs. Oh, oh, oh. That's a free fall. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Placing them into the corner. Oh, right to the body. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Oh, he's got him up high. Slam. My goodness, came down like a hammer on that arm. He gets tagged in. Oh, uncorked a big punch. Draping double axe handle. Tag team offense on the way. The boot of the boom. Got 
him. Caught with a clothesline. Back in the net, getting worked over. Carl evades that one. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Uh oh, Sandman! Pile driver! The Sandman can have this one. Makes a cover! Oh, the referee, the unfortunate victim of that hit. Yeah, that can't be good. And Sandman has been taking an enormous amount of abuse in this match. We knew Anderson had this in him. We knew... Tag made the OC. Uh-oh, perhaps looking to put an end to this with the Magic Killer. Look at the Sandman. His lights are off. Fights out at two. He refuses to stay down. Pure instinct. Oh, no, no, no. A big splash. There he goes, right into the corner. Caught him right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. Shoulder tackle after shoulder tackle. Kick to the gut. Creates separation. And he had the Sandman's number there. Hey, here he goes for the win. Then he closes it out. Sweet, sweet victory. Here are your winners. Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows, the OC. Facing some serious adversity and still coming out on top. This is a well-earned win, no question there. Toughness was on display in this one. Just such a thrill to see that kind of opposition get overcome. I guess nothing could stand in their way tonight. They were committed to getting the W. Guys, shut up. I got this. It's fight night! The following contest is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, accompanied by Ridge Holland at a combined weight of 472 pounds. The Celtic Warrior, Sheamus, and Butch, the brawling Bruce. That smash mouth, in your face style, that's what the Brutes are all about. What they do in that ring is a typical Saturday night at the pub. So that should give you an idea of the kind of dudes the Brutes are. 
The Brutes look more than ready to compete. Corey, what's your analysis? Banger. And their opponents, accompanied by Jinder Mahal, at a combined weight of 572 pounds, Veer Mahan and Sunga Indus Sheer. Oftentimes with teams, you know one member is better than the other. These are two superstars who are equally high level. With the Brawling Brutes in action, you just know that sooner or later, this is going to devolve into one of those all-out brawls right in front of us. A team of proud, proud men love to fight. Love to fight, love to get a little rowdy. I wouldn't go as far as to call the Brutes hooligans, but I would suggest all bystanders clear the way when the Brutes are around. Yeah, easier said than done when it's fight night. Anyone could end up on the Brutes' bad side. Yeah, but they've got Indus Share casting a long shadow on them from across the ring. Absolute behemoths looking to lay waste to anyone who stands in their way. Yeah, they made it clear they want nothing but the top prizes in the tag team division. Well, that'll do some serious damage. There's a tag. into the pin gets the shoulder up after one not getting a two count at this point has to be frustrating dominating shoulder tackle what the heck is this manager doing looking under the ring he can't be acting like this put into the corner now he deflects it right back Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. What a splash! Massive damage to the whole body. And Butch fending him off. Torturous focus on the leg. Ooh, pain must be shooting through that leg now. Arm ringer applied. Oh my goodness, that might have snapped a finger. The stress that was put on those joints could have some latent effects. And he wants nothing to do with any of that. One step ahead of Veer there. Split overhand chop. taking care of business with that attack. Focused attack on the back. And here comes Sheamus in off the tag. Perfect vertical. 
vertical suplex. He went right into that turnbuckle. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Not a whole lot you can do with a bum wing, guys. Uh, tag made. Oh, man. He wasn't tough enough contending with one opponent. Now you gotta deal with two. Countered it just in time. Counters on counters. Technical prowess on display. Bad predicament right here. Planet face first. Jeez. And Saga was opened up there. Oh. oh my! Oh. Connects on the kick. Watch this Herculean power. Deadlift back suplex. The amount of force behind that is enough to knock a normal person out. Sonda fears no man. And we might be about to go from commentators to participants in this one, fellas. He's back in so close to a count out. You do not want to lose that way. Up and around, down with a tilt the world backbreaker. Over and over again, getting beaten down with force. And Saga was on the wrong end there. Sheamus was clearly enjoying the fight when he landed that hit. Two. Ooh. And Veer's having trouble managing this onslaught. Can Mahan recover from this adversity? on its way from the very top rope. No, even higher from their partner's shoulders. Crashing down hard with a senton. Oh, oh, what a kick. Ooh, well measured. Solely focused on in the corner. Sanga fires back. Oh, oh, this is oh. arm drag reversal. And this deep end, you gotta start wondering. Tag. What do they have in mind here? Boom kick. Butch can put it away here. That's a pretty big win. Here are your winners. The Celtic Warrior, Sheamus and Butch. The Brawling Brutes. And Sheamus is the one to put this one away for the team. You got to think the Brutes are buying around at the pub after this sort of win.
Tag, uh, tag team action so now from behind an ambush in an attack. This match hasn't even started. It may not get started. These two are laying waste to the opposition. Tilting the match in their favor, of course. Obviously, this tag team giving themselves a distinct advantage before the match officially starts. Well, after a shocking surprise attack while entering, this match is finally underway. We'll just have to wait and see how that little scuffle alters the balance of power in this contest. Little scuffle? I think you're downplaying what we just saw unfold in front of us. Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat. And she's stunned in the corner. Oh, look at this aggression in the corner. Yeah, boot right in the jaw. That's telling your opponent, you don't deserve to share this stage with me. My God, enough! And she goes for the pin. Oh, still got more fight here. There's a tag. What are we going to see here? Double team effort. Double shoulder block. Putting up a united front as this match continues. A uh, quick response to Fire's offense. Uh oh. Alba shifts that to her favor. Yes, tag! Yeah. Oh, just turn that around. Yeah. Getting set up for something in the corner. that few take it to, but when they do, it's all out war. Ooh, she just turned it around. Close line! In off the tag. Oh, that was
was just malicious. Just disrespectful. So this could also light a fire under you. Make your fight even harder.
A little cockiness here from Don. Uh-oh. High angle belly to back suplex. Look out! Exploder suplex! And that's gonna put Chelsea on the wrong course. You can tell Isla's waning, but still might have enough to deliver one final blow. A little cockiness here from Dom. Deep into the arsenal. Here, the goalie bar. Cover. Chelsea on the receiving end. Butterflies the arms, head over into a suplex. Double stop! Partner tags in. Big forearm. Made her pay for her mistake. Mat slam with some attitude. And she'll make the tag. Boss man slam. She's enduring some dick. Party's over. Good night. She faked her out. No, she kicks out. Incredible to think. After everything we've witnessed, we are still at a stalemate. In the face. She 
He's on unsteady legs in the corner, needs to recover. To the face, had that one telegraphed. I thought for sure that was it. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. What energy in the arena tonight. Oh, God. That looked devastating. Uh, Chelsea obviously wants no part of her opponent. Or her opponent smells bad. Into the corner. This can't be good. Chelsea on the receiving end. Knees meet face. Tagged in. Bone. arm. Driving a knee into the arm. That assault halting all but inner tracks. Yeah, they've stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. And a tag there. Fez press and Fez press. Using the ropes. She's staying elusive. She's pushed into the corner. Reversal after reversal. These two are ready for each other. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. Alba shifts that to her favor. And did you hear the impact of that? She's tagged in. Piper taking a step back and measuring her opponent. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Double big back body drop. Nice first. Fire scaling the turnbuckles. Oh, it's gonna happen. Alba Fire with a swan time. Game set match for Alba Fire. Set right into the corner. 
Using their boot on the throat in the corner. Had that one scouted. Knife edge chop. She's going to try it again. Oh, what a double team. Fires down and she might be out. Makes the cover. Oh, come on, ref. Get some control. Shut up, Byron. are right in the corner. Flying shoulder block! My goodness. And again, fire gets caught by the opposition. Chelsea might be thinking about ending things sooner rather than later. Tag! Here she comes! The suspense this crowd. Inverted face lock! Driven down with an elbow to the heart. Dog can taste it now. Stop to the leg. A heel hook locked in. You can almost hear the opponents yelling in agony. Oh, shoulder to the gut. All oh, this. So ruthless. Tag. Opponent off the ropes. Double big back body drop. Oh man. Oh. Bottom bicycle knee strike. Oh, oh. oh job. Ah, oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Connor with a kick, creating a little space. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Josie Green has set her sights on her opponent now. A oh, double knee face breaker. to victory. But they got there in the end despite taking an unexpected beating earlier. What a display of courage, battling to the win against all odds. A lot of people probably thought that sneak attack sealed their fate.
Time to wake up because you can't sleep on Wendy Chu. Well, it's easy to discount her and her napping ways, but trust me, Chu is the real deal. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Chinatown, New York, Wendy Chu! Wendy Chu, always dressed for comfort, but more than ready for a fight. And you definitely don't want to get run over by the Wendy Chu Chu train. Yes, I do. A real train. Hey, hey, look alive. Look alert out there. Hey, you can't underestimate the Wendy Chu Chu train. You sleep in a race car bed, Saxton. Leave me alone, Corey. If looks could kill. I don't think I even need to finish my sentence, gentlemen. And from Sin City, Scarlet! Don't judge a book by its cover. Scarlet is second fiddle to no one. And she is just as dangerous in the ring as she is out of it. The time for mind games is over. It's time for Scarlet to cause some physical damage. And we begin with a superstar who I can't really make heads or tails of, and that's Wendy Chu. Nine times out of 10, Wendy Chu's doing an impression of the audience when Saxton talks. But when that alarm clock hits, there are very few competitors as efficient and unorthodox as she is. She's really becoming one of my favorites to watch. I think a lot of people would agree with you, Corey. You can't count out Scarlet, though. We know just how dangerous she can be behind the scenes in the Shroud of Darkness. But in that ring, she can be just as dangerous. Believe me. Close line! Off with their head. Strong right forearm. She had it scouted. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. Finds a counter for Chu. Big knee to the midsection. And Wendy moves. Unbelievable athleticism. Acrobatics like that take a tremendous amount of cardio and strength. You really have to be confident in your athletic ability to pull off a standing moonsault like that. Doesn't go well if you still can't get more than a one count by now. So unpredictable is Wendy Chu. How do you counter someone who seems to be making it up as she goes along? Get on her level. Don't let the cutesy PJs fool you. Choose nuts. You need to throw whatever sense of normalcy you had out the window and expect that this is going to be a very unusual match. Once you understand that, you can fight accordingly. Forearm! Forearm to the jaw. And now Scarlet is under immense pressure. Yeah, Chu's appearing unstoppable. Oh, did you see that? Agility like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. Nelson into the slam. Hard-fought victory for this superstar tonight. 
And for, oh. look at this! Oh, 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 with a oh, oh, oh. stick! Are you kidding me? What's the meaning behind this? We'll find out in due time. But the message was sent crystal clear. Here comes our Tribal Chief. Perhaps the most dominant champion in WWE history. The head of the table, Roman Reigns. The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida. Weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman. I've been at this table for decades, and I've never seen a competitor this dominant. Month in, month out, Reigns continues to dominate. Yeah, but think about this, Corey. The man who finally puts a loss in Roman's record will become immortal. It's bold of you to think he'll even lose. Well, even with the competition at this level, you might be right.
record-breaking champion, an unbeatable competitor. That's why every time Roman competes, it is a history-making moment. but he's also really freaking good. And he has the titles and main events to prove it. I don't think anybody in WWE runs their mouth quite as much as Seth freaking Rollins. Yeah, but nobody delivers on their promises like he does either. The czar of WWE, Ilya Dragunov. Superstars more ferocious than Ilya Dragunov. Well, that ferocity, Saxton, has led Dragunov to the NXT UK Championship. Let's see if it brings him more success tonight. that trademark unflinching gaze. There is no telling what's going through the mind of the czar of WWE. Taking out a competitor like Dragunov is always unnerving. Here we go, triple threat matchup, and in this one, you've got to keep an eye out for these superstars taking advantage of the stipulations. Things are now underway with Roman Reigns, Seth Rollins, and Ilya Dragunov. It's every competitor for themselves, gentlemen, and I guarantee all three superstars are thinking about that right now. I honestly can't imagine thinking about anything else in a triple threat match. I understand going into this with a strategy and a plan, but I have to think that flies right out the window once the bell rings. Oh, oh man! Oh, and Ilya turns the tables. He's rummaging for some sort of equalizer underneath the ring. What a suplex. Able to reverse that one. Rollins just a step too slow. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. Averting danger with an elbow to the stomach. 
Getting him into the corner. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Adding a level of insult with that kind of physicality. And that was a precisely measured attack. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. Big reversal by Rollins. Slight blade! This is some situation, Byron. What is going through the minds of these superstars? It is so important that these combatants keep their cool. When you're running on sheer adrenaline, you are more apt to make a mistake. I think these competitors will proceed with caution and continue to feel each other out to see who will go for the first big move. And he's out of there in a nick of time. Can't prepare your face for that. Oh my God, a cold line. Turns it around, sole of foot meets the stomach. Well executed hip toss. Funky butt love it. He's got a baseball bat. Oh, oh swung for the fences. And he goes for the pin. Fending off a two count there. Just kicking out at one takes a lot in a match like this. Dragging off, messing with him, clearly trying to force an error. Man. Oh, ouch. Uh-oh. Comes off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. Rollins with an old mod. Double underarm hook. Blocked and into a clothesline. Superman punch. Gonna carry it around. Bad spot to be in. Huge top. This could be it. Cover. He forces a break before the count of two. Kicking out there really has to make his opponent question his game plan. Drag it off. My side headlock applied. Oh, for a good punch. measure. For the pin and the win. Yes. Big Ooh. forearm. Hoisted up. All the way out. Suplex. Oh, well. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Head to the pay window. Kick out. Nasty. They weren't that good looking anyway. Rip cord. Oh my goodness. Nasty line. And he stops the count. Vicious right forearm. He moved, but can he capitalize? Look at this. Oh, from the rope. Textbook jumping clothesline. Oof. Able to get the advantage here. Getting set up for something in the corner. Look at this. Going right after the left arm. Got to hurt. In the middle row, looking up there, holding. Tornado snap suplex. Amazing. He's looking a little weary now. After lasting this long in a triple threat, it'd be a shame to take a nosedive now. Whoa! Turn that kendo stick into a lawn dart. This is what he feeds off of. Moments like this, this big match feel. Oh my gosh, what impact! Hoping to end it here. Such a long and hard-fought match. He earned that victory. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns. What a tremendous effort from all three superstars involved in this hard-hitting triple threat. To win a triple threat match, you need incredible skill, instincts, or luck. Dare I say, tonight's winner showed all three in victory.
Here comes the Scottish warrior. A man whose mean streak grows by the day. McIntyre answers to no one and fights only for himself. Yeah, Drew is hell-bent on having his arm raised tonight, and I would not want to be the one to stand in his way. between Drew McIntyre and his goals. Whether the WWE Universe supports him or not, Drew will stay on the top of the food chain in WWE. Drew McIntyre has an unparalleled focus, refuses to let the outside noise get to him. Yeah, as clear-headed as a superstar can be, which only makes him even more dangerous. The Apex Predator is on the hunt. And his opponent from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 275 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton. A third generation superstar who had no hesitation when it came to creating his own path when it comes to creating his own legacy. Randy Orton has done just that. But prior to NXT and the WWE Performance Center, it has been said, if you were going to build a WWE superstar from the ground up, it would look exactly like Randy Orton. Has every tool needed to be a legend. Somehow, some way, this guy is going to need to seize control from the Scottish Warrior. But trust me, McIntyre is not going to go down without a hell of a fight. for action with the Scottish warrior Drew McIntyre. For him, it's all about the thrill of battle, standing to your ground and emerging victorious. McIntyre sends his opponents into agony with terrifying power backed by the fury of centuries of Scottish warriors. The ring is his battleground. Drew McIntyre will slay opponents down one by one if that's what it takes to prove he's the greatest warrior in WWE. And we cannot ignore just how dangerous Randy Orton can be. As calculating and methodical in his attacks as you possibly can be. You got that right, Saxton. Orton's definitely the type of superstar you have to keep your head on a swivel for. 
The voices in his head are always maniacal. His mind is always going, and it's going to the places that aren't too pleasant for the competition. Crashing down like that, having the wind knocked out of you, never a good time for that to happen. Drops the elbow. And he's out of there in a nick of time. Side slam. Nice. Hip toss. And that was an effective attack, guys. Looks like they do not want them inside the ring anymore. Time to venture outside the ropes. Hooked up. Shin breaker. Down to opponent. His shoulders are down. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Comes down across the head with the axe handle. And McIntyre getting clobbered there. When the Viper strikes, he does not hold back. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. And now McIntyre is being neutralized. Orton remains as dangerous as they come, and McIntyre getting a first-hand experience of that fact. Held in a perilous position. Oh, God, face first! Taking this to the floor. Look at Orton here. Oh. Fall away slam. Was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Oh, stop right to the hand. You gotta wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. Oh, face stop. Measuring. Oh, a stiff boot to the face. Nasty stop to finish it off. It is very clear that Drew McIntyre is feeling the physicality of this contest. He needs to get himself some room to regroup fast. Randy Orton showing no mercy. Rarely do we see Drew get disassembled like this. This is going to get ugly. Air raid. That's all it takes. Is it enough? Two. What? Oh, he kicked out. We'll see if this is the start of a rally. Saw that one coming. Boom! Claymore delivered. Will Drew make a cutter? Amazing! That was amazing. Orton is still in this. The Viper still has a lot of fight left in him. And you know McIntyre loves a challenge, but he better not let his opponent hang around for too long. Whoa. Orton with the fence press, and now by Randy Orton. Toss back into the ring. Wow, and now McIntyre is wearing a crimson mask. Two, he, no way, no way. The Scottish warrior refusing to lay down his sword just yet, but you have to think that took a lot out of him. The Viper cannot believe this. That should have ended this match, but it continues. McIntyre and Orton know this is all about so much more than winning now. This is about pride. This is about solidifying supremacy. And neither man will stop until they achieve that goal. We might be here for a long time, and I, for one, am more than fine with that. Snap suplex. McIntyre is getting dismantled. The attacks will not relent from the Viper. He isn't taking this lying down anymore. Drew weathered the storm and wants to create some of his own thunder now. Suplex! Compromise.
position here. Piercing the throat. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. Jarring impact. Oh, he had the wherewithal to counter McIntyre. Boy, the European uppercut. Vicious right forearm. No, oh, McIntyre. Manhandling his opponent. His Drew McIntyre. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Orton with a Fez press, and now here come the punches. with the Apex Predator, and he slayed the Viper. What a win for McIntyre. Drew McIntyre. Wow, this is so exciting. Oh, oh, oh. This, is, this competitor oh. is in no time. What a this is close for the bell. Completely unloading on their opponent. The officials restored some semblance of order. Now they can throw down proper. No use wasting any more time. These into the quick cover. No kicks out in time. He actually got pretty far there for such an early pin. Vicious right forearm. Setting up. Nice suplex. He's turning the tables. Oh, 
by the throat into the top rope. Oof. From way up the top, oh. down. Theory is known for his cocky attitude, for his showboating in and out of the ring. Would you consider that a hindrance to him here in this one, or is it the kind of mind games that could be beneficial to him? In this particular case, Cole, I think Theory could stand to cut back on the showboating. I think he's up against someone who isn't going to take too kindly to it, and I'm pretty sure they'll put an end to it in a way of their own if Theory won't himself. Theory's hopes are waning. And credit where credit's due, he's not letting Theory get into his head, not letting him showboat. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. that very few superstars can perform with such ease. Fight is so close to our announce table. Yeah, I'm just gonna step aside now. Hey, wait for me! Referee's count here. Jumping neck breaker. Ouch. Oh, sharp knee. Look at this. Just unloading. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Williams had that well scouted. And he's taking this to the outside now. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Scoop slam! Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. He fends off the attack. Escapes with a knee to the gut. Oh, what a Can he do it here? And that will end it. Here is your winner, Trick Williams. Well, this win says it all. Even if you pull out all the stops, there's no shortcut to victory. I mean, credit where it's due. This match really put them to the test. And they ought to be very proud of passing that test.